of the case of a victim's family speaking out on behalf of the man accused in the drunk driving death of their loved one because they're cousins. WLWT News Size Andrew Setters live with more on the case, the sentence, Andrew, and why the family is supporting the defendant. Bring us up to date. Yeah, Lisa, Joshua Seals' attorney called this the most difficult kind of case because the victim's own mother stood up to ask for leniency. The cousins were out celebrating Dominique Carter's birthday when he was killed. Today, Tanya Seal came to court and sat beside the young man whose actions took her son's life. Back in April, Joshua Seal got behind the wheel after drinking. He crashed, killing his cousin, 21 year old Dominique Carter, and injuring two passengers. He entered a guilty plea in the case and came into court this morning facing the possibility of going to prison. His aunt and grandmother both spoke out asking the judge to take it easy on Seal because he and the rest of the family are already suffering a loss. I want you to know I forgive him and I love him. Dominique loves him and he loves Dominique. I just ask for leniency when you make your final decision. Well, Judge Beth Myers was not as tough on Seal as she could have been. He faced the possibility of five years in prison. He was sent instead to a lockdown treatment program and given five years probation with frequent drug and alcohol testing. Judge Myers told him she'll lock him up for five full years if he violates his probation. Lisa?